Hey there YouTube, I'm just a dude with a uke. Today I'm going to be doing another little piece out of my favorite ukulele mic songbook here, This Little Light of Mine. Um, it's kind of a short little piece, so after it's over, please stick around and if you're interested, I'll tell you all about how I got started on my ukulele journey with this little guy right here. I hope you enjoy this little light of mine. So there you go. This little light of mine, uh, as arranged by Ukulele Mike uh, in his instrumental songbook, I hope you enjoyed it. So one of you asked not that long ago how long I've been playing, and the short answer to that is about five and a half years. So um, maybe I should give you a little background here. Uh, I am by no means a, 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 a musician by trade. Uh, I'm an IT guy. I manage IT projects and service management and that sort of thing. Uh, I really have very little musical training. Some of my Facebook peeps will remember um, will remember this this whoa this nerd this guy from <laughs> from uh, from marching band. So I played clarinet uh, when I was in school. Uh, until I graduated high school, uh, was never particularly good at it to speak of, and, and that was just about it. I, I went off on my way and started making my way in the world, and then, gosh, well, a long time ago, I had a, uh, a roommate with a guitar, and I learned a few chords there and really loved it, and um, I always joke and I say I learned just enough music to woo my wife. I had learned Blackbird, a couple of chord progressions, some a little bit of blues riffing, but that was really about it. Uh, then, when my son was born, I thought it important that uh, we expose him to some music. I grew up uh, with a family that was playing um, piano and singing and and those sort of things. My sisters and my mother, in particular. Um, so I thought it important to expose him to music, so I got out and dusted off my old guitar and I started learning a few uh, few kid songs here and there, and playing to him when he was really young. I'll try and flash up some pictures here somewhere. Uh, at any rate, a uh, young little boy started picking around at the guitar and breaking strings and it was just this enormous thing for him. And I went into a music store to replace the strings and I saw a tiny soprano ukulele hanging on the wall there and I started thinking, man, that would be something a little bit more his speed as he gets a little older. He could, he could play that. So I went home and I got online and I found this little guy right here uh, for about 50 bucks. It's a little mahogany soprano, uh, nothing special plywood. Uh, but then when I got it in my hands, here in my home and I got it tuned up uh, I decided well I need to show him there's a this is a real instrument and so I started learning a song or two uh, and and the rest is as they say history so from that moment on I basically played my ukulele at least for a few minutes just about every day not because it's a chore but I just can't help myself uh, and you know what they say is the best musical instruments are the ones that you play so the one that I pick up and I play, even though I have a clarinet, I have a mandolin, I used to have guitars, the one I pick up and I play every day is our humble friend, the ukulele. It just, it just makes me happy. And so that's my story. So my son is just about to turn seven 
Uh, I purchased my first ukulele when he was about a year and a half, and and now, by goodness, I am a ukulele player, and I'm delighted that we're making music as a family, singing and, and playing songs, and that's the thing about the ukulele, is you just, it's just such a delightful instrument to play, so easy and, and fun. Uh, you know, I get over a guitar, I love the sound of a guitar, but when I get over it, I just feel so, it feels just more serious like the ukulele is one it's okay to just pick it up and sing poorly if you like and uh, but still make some beautiful music so there you go YouTube that's my story I hope I haven't rambled on too long and as always please like subscribe and comment down below and thank you for stopping by